perfect weather today, Andrew. Perfect. I mean, it was absolutely, it couldn't have been any better, I don't think. It's crazy. It really is. Would yeah. you like a repeat tomorrow? I sure. would love it. Would love it. Well, we can deliver. There you go. We've got more coming for tomorrow, folks. Look at the high today. 67 degrees, way above by 13 degrees, our average high for this time of year. Now, off the record by 7 degrees, 74, just set last, uh, last year in 2015. Can you believe it? And the low temperature this morning, 38, which is right on target. In fact, lows tonight will be around the same mark, mostly upper 30s and low 40s. Here in the metro zone in your four zone weather, low 40s all around for the most part from Troy and Birmingham to West Bloomfield, downtown Detroit, Clinton Township and just downriver in places like Ecorse and Trenton. South of Michigan Avenue in our south zone, same sort of deal with mostly clear skies overhead. Temperatures down to 40 to 42 degrees overnight. West of 275 in our west zone, Livingston County, a little bit chillier, but nowhere near freezing. 39, one of the lower temps in places like uh, Howell. Same thing to our north with temps down to 37 up north of uh, Hall Road in places like Yale, low 40s, upper 30s also in St. Clair and Santa Lac counties. Look at that sunset occurring right now. Yeah, just last few glimpses as sunset this evening is in just a couple of moments from now at around 621. But remember, sunset tomorrow an hour earlier because of daylight saving time coming to an end. Temperatures right now, even with the setting sun, between 60 and 64 degrees. Even in our north zone in Lapeer, it's now 62. And beautiful colors. Under these blue skies, we've got beautiful reds, oranges, yellows down here on our, on our foliage. Here we are in Detroit with peak conditions right now here in Detroit and southeast Michigan. Just past peak in places like Grand Rapids and northern and central portions of the Lower Peninsula. Way past peak in parts of the UP. Now remember, a couple other great ideas in addition to turning those clocks back one hour before going to bed. Make sure you change the batteries in your smoke detectors and for security security purposes, make sure those accounts that are time sensitive and that are digital, make sure those clocks remain on time too later on tonight. 64 right now in Mount Clemens, Pinckney checking in at 63 degrees. All these temps, <laughs> yeah, you guessed it, 10, 11 degrees above what they were just 24 hours ago. And the warming trend continues into tomorrow. You can see higher temperatures or temperatures right about the same where we are, just off to our west. The warm air remains over us. I mean, it's already in the 70s in places like Minneapolis and Des Moines. Well, it remains relatively warm with high pressure overhead, stable air through the day tomorrow and even into Monday and take a look at the seven day forecast. I'll show you that in a second. You're really going to like that into election day and beyond. 43 degrees overnight. Now there might be some patchy fog by tomorrow morning. So when you join me tomorrow morning on local four news today, watch out for some areas of low visibility. But by tomorrow afternoon, temperatures back in the low and middle 60s around 62 to 64 for a high. Same thing on Monday with more sunshine coming back. And I told you like the ne next seven days. Take a look election day. Wow. Looking good for voters, 40s in the morning, 60 in the afternoon. Sure, a bit cooler by the end of next week, but remaining dry. And those temps that you see at the end of next week, that's seasonable.